There will be a big funeral in Hamilton today for the former head of the local motorcycle gang, the Outcast, who died in Waikato Hospital on Tuesday after a short illness. Gregory James Papish, who was better known as Smokey, was leader of the Outcast for more than three years. He was widely respected by gang members and by the police. 24-year-old Smokey Papish was the son of Eric and the late Charlotte Papish. He was physically a big man, but it was more his personality than his size that commanded respect and friendship from people of all walks of life. Smokey belonged to the outcasts for about eight years, and during his time as gang leader, he established unusually good relations with the police. Senior Sergeant Ian Patterson says he was always reasonable and cooperative, and during the big bikey convention held at Tarapa two years back, it was Smokey who kept the peace. After leaving the outcasts last year, he took an interest in university studies, although he still retained his love for motorbikes. Dozens of motorcyclists are expected at today's funeral service, and the roar of motorbikes will be a fitting farewell. This is Owen Poland. President Trotter has announced a stringent national energy saving program, including ship increases in petrol tax, to deal with what he calls America's greatest domestic challenge. He appealed to Congress and all Americans to accept his measures as a matter of patriotism. Congress has so far reacted unfavorably to advanced reports of Mr. Carter's program, and the controversial petrol tax hike has been given less than a 50-50 chance of being accepted. 